Have you ever been in Google Chrome and you've been looking for something like maybe an escape room? How do you build an escape room? And you're on, wow, this looks really good, but I don't really have time to read all this right now. So I want to look at this a little bit later. And you don't really want to bookmark it because you don't really know if you want to keep this. So let me show you. There is a reading list that is built right into Google Chrome that you can use to temporarily save this. So if you go up to the top right hand corner beside your little icon and you'll click here where it says show side panel. So I'm going to click on that and it's going to show the side panel. And this is where the reading list is. So if I want to add this current tab to the reading list, I just click add current tab. And now that adds it to my reading list. So maybe I'm looking at another one and I want to add that to again, I can click add current tab. Now, if I go back later and I'm in something else, another tab, and I want to open up the reading list. So I would just simply click here to show the side panel again, and I'll see my reading list. And then I want to go back to read this uh, build a digital escape room. So I'm just going to click on it and it's going to take me to that tab so that I can go back and read about how to build a digital escape room. Now, if I'm done with this and I really am not sure yet, maybe I still want to refer back to it, but I've kind of read it. Um, I can just click this check mark right here. And that's going to put it in pages that I've read. Or if I don't want it at all, I can simply go to the X and delete it. So now I still have this in pages I've read and maybe I want to go back and I want to add another tab. And so then it's all here for me when I'm ready to go ahead and read this. So I hope this helps and I hope that you actually get time to go back and read things that you want to.